Legislative efforts and legal challenges in recent years have focused on the protocol surrounding when police can legally collect a suspect's DNA. The question of how to handle shed or touch DNA has largely slipped through without much debate or opposition. We all shed DNA, leaving traces of our identity practically everywhere we go. In fact, the garbage you leave for curbside pickup is a potential gold mine of this sort of material. All of this shed or so-called abandoned DNA is free for the taking by local police investigators hoping to crack unsolvable cases, shed DNA is also free for inclusion in a secret universal DNA databank. What this means is that if you leave your DNA traces anywhere a crime has been committed, you've already got a file somewhere in some state or federal database. The science fiction future, in which police can swiftly identify robbers and murderers from discarded soda cans and cigarette butts, has arrived. Genetic fingerprinting is set to become as routine as the old-fashioned kind.